Well, good evening, everyone. Good evening. My name is Mike Hurst. I'm the Science Fair Coordinator for School District 148. Uh, welcome tonight. Um, all of our seventh grade students across the district uh, uh, have the opportunity to participate in this fair. All of them do a science project as part of the seventh grade curriculum uh, for science. Out of the 65 seventh grade students, right, here are your top 12. So let's give them a round of applause. You know, they started on their projects back in September. They worked on them through October and November. Uh, and here we are at the science fair now in December. And behind them, not only during that time, but tonight in the seating too, uh, are the parents of our students, right? So let's give them a round of applause. Thank you for your hard work and your help getting our students ready for tonight. Uh, the other thing I wanted to review for you now is the, uh, just like we have our sports teams go to the state competition, we want our academics to show that same way. So this is the first step in going to the state competition. Students who do well enough here tonight, we are going to form our science team from Washington Junior High. Those students will be invited to the regional science fair in March. If they do well enough there, uh, they will be invited to the state science fair uh, the first weekend in May down at Milliken University, where all of the scientists, the young scientists from across the state will gather to show off their projects. Now, this is uh, just the beginning. Uh, I want to introduce you to uh, Mrs. Skinner, right? Our seventh grade teacher is here joining us as well. Thank you, Mrs. Skinner, for being here. Before I get started, I just want to say that these students in front of you have worked very hard, very diligently with their projects. Some of them have stayed after school um, working on these projects. Um, this is a lot of their first time completing a science project. So I just want to commend each and every one of you all for being showing your best. Because whether you make the district team or not, you have proven to me that you deserve to be here tonight. And all of you will receive A's on your science boards and your science projects for the semester. Now, without any further ado, um, I would like to say congratulations to Tiana Crawford. She's earned a bronze award for her science project. Now we're moving on to our silver awards. We have congratulations to Morel Sip. Maisha Tucker. Emiliano Lopez, he had to leave. Mariah Brown, Man Manaya Brown. Jada Witherspoon. Marcellus Coleman. Echo Harris. Carmelo Burkett. And Genesis Jordan. We are now moving on to our gold medal winners for our 2023-24 science fair and our first gold medal winter winner is goes to Caleb Holyfield the last name the last name we're going to call uh, not only is a gold award winner but received the highest score overall this person will be invited to our board of education meeting in February to present their project and to receive a special award from the Board of Education. And that person is Jariah Sanford. Now, 
you may have noticed, right, that we have three other medals up here. There are, so we have two people on our team so far, right? Uh, our two gold medal winners are going to go to the regional fair. We would like to invite three other students who received a silver award. They were so close to gold that we felt we should push them over the top and uh, invite them to the regional fair. So here are our three uh, students who will join the team for the regional fair. Our first gold medal recipient joining the team is Echo Harris. Our second Golden Award person joining the team is Myesha Tucker. And our third and final gold medal recipient joining our team is Manaya Brown. Again, whether you receive gold, silver, bronze, you made it to the top. You were the creme de la crown. And I am very proud of each and every one of you. And don't hold your head down because you all did an excellent job. Thank you.